basic light work tricks because my ankle's still bugging. You're gonna do you're gonna do so many sick tricks. You're gonna learn a trick yeah. with a hurt ankle. That's my goal today. I tried to do a front smith earlier and it was like Yeah. It didn't could... hurt, I was just the fear was in my Oh you're scared of it. Well yeah. it didn't hurt. No, we're learning a trick today. We're gonna learn a trick while you're hurt. How to learn a trick while you're injured. I just created your video for you. How to learn a trick while you're sore. Yeah. Let me let's just play the play the same. Like that's right. That's like the only trick I do. Tail. Okay. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say 50-50-180. Oh, that was a really good front tail. Oh, sliding nose. Oh, we're in fish eye mode. Let's try backside. Back tail? Oh, early for back tails. I'm ready when you are. I'm filming fish eye mode. If you didn't know this. Uh, he has a new phone. I got a new phone because I dropped my phone and it shattered and I wasn't going to spend another $300 on the screen. Yeah, fuck that. Alright, here we go. Whoa, whoa. That was a crazy looking back tail. How many tries it's going to take for you to get a front smith? Yeah. I think you're going to do a first try. Damn. We'll see because I can... Um, I keep getting in the front lip, but on that angle. Because you're because you're can... hesitant. That's all. Yeah. Oh, front lip guy. What's that? It doesn't hurt. Oh, yeah, this is scary because my I'm battling that mental fear. I gotta go to a hypnotist or something. You know when they hypnotize you to not be afraid and how to stop smoking and stuff. Yeah, you're gonna quit smoking. Yeah. So you're gonna start smoking and then not be able to smoke, friend. I see it. Yeah, forcing yourself to not be scared is like the most difficult thing when you're coming back from an injury. Because you built up that muscle memory of hesitating because you're afraid it's going to hurt and now that you're not hurt anymore, even though you are still hurt. Is that it? I don't think so. But this is right here. This is it. This is the one. I lied. How can you back tail but you can't smith grind? Doesn't make any sense. Back tail's like the scariest trick. Front smith's the safest trick. Okay, just do it right here. Ollie the baby. Get that toe side pinch. Or I guess it's heel. I don't know. Finally. How many goes is that? A dozen? That was first try. You, you're editing this. You this can, this can be whatever you want. My body feels unco uncoordinated. Because you don't skate, you don't do your go to so often, you end up being unco. Unco? That's a word, unco. Unco is a word? Yeah, uncoordinated. Unco. Yeah. You so, don't say that it here? sounds like a clothing company where their mascot is like a clown with a knife. Could be. That's your new. There is my clothing company. Dude, let's do another small back tails. That yeah. Was, that was fun. Let's do some back tails. I'd like to get you to back tail the, the straight out ledge into That's the a back. Long one. No, you don't have to go out the whole thing, just like into okay. the ledge. Let's and then a little a front point down the rail. Let's do a few more on this. And yeah. We'll go over there. We're going to do a few more on this, and then we're going to go to there. I'm reiterating what he said so it adds up to more time in this video so it's longer, more ads. Oh! oh. 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 oh yeah. Do it again. Yeah. That was a tap off, but... Do another one. Alright. Do all the back tails. I felt better. Yeah, that was a lot better. Let's try it over here. Try to do a little back tail into the bank. First try. Yeah, you gotta drop into the top, dude. You gotta, you gotta fully go for it. Wow. Oh, first try. That's your thumbnail, like you set up to drop in. Like a, you know, every thumbnail on a big vert ramp or quarter pipe is like them set up to drop in. Yeah. This, like, get a thumbnail of you set up to drop in on this. Yeah, <laughs> that'd be sick. Haley dropped in on the vert ramp when we were at Braille. Really? Yeah, she did a first try.
Yeah, and then she French kissed me. Smoke that back tail. Oh, I blew it. I stopped recording and started recording again. Oh! I assure you, this was all one line. Don't don't rat yourself out. Oh, you're better with a hurt ankle. First try of Don being back. Really? Yeah. It was not. I feel a bad like I ran a marathon. The fact that you try to commit to the first tray since you've been back is kind of yeah. Like I always will put the foot around flip tricks I haven't done in a while and like stick it with one foot before I actually put my feet on it. That was an ugly tray though, but yeah, but you did it. It is what it is. That's way better than not committing to it and flipping a good one. Yeah. Alright. So now what are you gonna do? Let's go to the rail. You got a little front board down the baby rail? Ooh. Let me get a few hits on the, on flat, the bar. flat bar. I feel like you know what it feels like. It feels like. I'm a new person trying to skate again. I don't feel like my old self skating. He's born again, people. Born again, skateboarder. Jesus walks! <laughs> Dirty dinner boy! Called out. I don't know. What about front board? Oh, no way. That's like the skating of this way is spooky. South out. What's that? Your back foot came off, but it was still solid. I thought it was cool again. I'd rather see someone land something like that than see like the most cookie cutter, boring front board ever. What is it? Oh, like a clean on front board. Okay. I mean, that was pretty clean. I say you either do 50 50 feeble or front board down the baby rail. Oh, yeah. Uh, that Smith grind's a heel lock, though. Smith grind might work, but not. That was perfect. That felt way better. Yeah, it looks way better. Switch skater. Oh, yeah. Oh, switch dude. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I need a more angle. Yeah, you couldn't have done it any better than that. Uh, you could do switch backboard back to switch. You know what would be cool? I can do it. Fakey, front board, to fakey. Oh, I love that trick. That doesn't have a name though, does it? It's fakey, like... fakey front board, fakey. Okay. You said it right. All right. Scary, man. So you're gonna, you're gonna do fakey front board back to fakey, which means his front truck's going over the rail. Let's, let's see if I can do a front 180 and then do it. Oh, oh you're doing a line? Yeah. All right, let's line. do it. Don't you mock me. You hear that? He's making fun of me, dude. <laughs> the line monster. First try. That wasn't much of a slide, but it, But you did it. it is. What about fakey front board though? Just what about the other way? What's that? That'd be like this way. Like that. Yeah, that way. You'd be going this way. Scary. That's no. the side either, huh? Yeah, but you're safer than you think. Because really? you're showing a fakey out. I feel like I'm gonna go like this. But you won't. Dude, if you fall, I'll catch you, dude. I'll try one. Ooh, yeah, that's what I like to hear. Try it before you buy it. Yeah, try it before you, what he said. How do you do it? You just fake, the rail's super baby, just tap it. Yep, just like that, tap it. Just tap it, just tap it. You can practice with one foot first. He's asking advice from him and he was just like, when you try it, just close your eyes. You're gonna do that. If you want, it helps me. For like board slide tricks that I'm scared of on rails, I'll get into it on a ledge where I feel safe. So I go slow, get into it to make sure I can ollie right, because that ledge is the same height as this flat bar if you just want to try to get into one going slow. Let's just try it. Okay, oh Let's yeah, okay, I guess it. I'm a fucking but coward. No, All right. I did, I just didn't fake only. Yeah, just a little fakey shuffle. That's all it is. Yeah. Just fake your 
Oh, you got it. Oh, okay. <laughs> like, hit a rock at the scariest point, like when he's about to crop the track. That's all it is. Okay, yeah, try. Yeah, you got it. I'm Fearful. For the slide. You got it. Just hop on, hop off. You're super safe. Too late. Okay, you need to get on a little earlier. You just fake your front someone eating the end of the rail. <laughs> super easy. <laughs> okay, but, but yeah, you got to go back to fakie like an adult. Oh, did I, I did it the, the wrong way, just like doing a only front loop. Well, it's not the wrong way. It just ain't the right way. You know what I mean? There's a difference between the two. So you're saying to me, go back to... Figgy. So you're doing a figgy shifty. Think of it as a figgy oh, shifty. Oh, I'm just going like this. Yeah, you figgy front 180 and the rail was in your way. I want you to figgy shifty with the rail in your way. Oh my gosh. You got it. Yeah. yeah. How cool does that trick feel? It feels cool. It's like a very, like... Pretzel-y. You ever watch snowboarders ride rails? Yeah. yeah. They, they do that weird stuff all the time where they're like... Plot twist. Yeah. A dust particle went into my eye. What a valid excuse. <laughs> when people say that one person can't change the world, one dust particle changed the course of his trick, you know? If that's not an inspirational quote, I don't know what is. He fell. There it is, slide, get on a little earlier. I would pop when my tail is about to get to this bar, so that way you'll get on right here. Uh, I get you. Because you're popping here and yeah. getting on here. Wherever you pop, you get on like a foot past it. Don't be scared. My weight was wrong. You need false confidence right here. Just like... We call that Dutch courage. Dutch courage? Yeah. That sounds racist, but... <laughs> let's... Sure. <laughs> I'll, I'll explain why after. We call it Dutch courage because when the Dutch come to Australia, they were like before the English and they would, they say the Australian accent's like a combination of like Dutch, English and Irish and being drunk, so. With a hint of racism, <laughs> sprinkled on top. I was kidding, but also. Earlier. There it is. It yeah, that counts. You did the trick, what do you mean does it count? Oh, hardest little trick in skateboarding. So, what we try, I'm gonna try to get a front nose grind down the hubba. For nose grind? Yeah, front tail, and then maybe a front board down the baby rail. Sounds good to me. So, little impact training? Is that what it is? Yeah. That's what we're gonna call it. Yeah, 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 as long as you land correct. Yeah. As long as you come correct. Let me get a front meet on it first and then. Okay. I know it's scary. You got okay, it. Okay, that's First try, Ooh. super easy. Only fear. That's all that was. Well, I feel like now that you felt the impact of the tail slide, you might as well tr at least try one nose grind. Alright. Try one. Okay. Is it acceptable to drag your nose on a front nose grind? It is. It is? A hundred percent. In fact, if you drag your nose on a 5.0, it's actually uh, insist up insisted upon. Oh. First try. You know what it was? What was it? Uh, the fear of any weight on my back, ankle, it's in my head, so I was like, Ugh. Really pushing that nose pushing grind Pushing that in. nose in. Yeah, that's sick. That was a good okay. nose grind. Thank you. No worries. Dying up the slide. I think this is also going to be first try. The fear and oh, it's, it's pretty wet. Fear and anxiety and skating. That's wet, dude. You got it. Hit that wet, that wet wow. ass pole. Wet ass pole. Worship and prayer. <laughs> yeah. There it is. Oh, oh! That was the most straight on pole jam. Ghost ride the whip. Super solid. That was easy. That's for, uh, that one was for 
Steve Irwin. Yes, yeah, Steve. Rest in soul. So uh, we had a pretty rad session at uh, out at El Sereno. It's a really fun park. My ankles finally starting to get better. Like I feel like skating on it definitely helps loosen it up. And um, I had a little bit of pain on a few tricks, but it kind of I kind of broke through that wall, if that makes sense. Like I was able to skate around, and so half the time I actually forgot that my ankle was sore. So that's definitely a good thing. And just walking in the mornings and stuff, my ankle's not so stiff and painful anymore. So super happy it's finally starting to get better. Shouts out to all the guys that we met up at El Sereno. They were from there was a couple from SF. I think there was a few of them from SF, and then um, one of them from Indiana. So I think it was Joe from Indiana. And then I think his name was Alex from SF. I didn't catch the other guys' names, but we had a we had a mad time, just like hanging out, sitting down in the shade because it was super hot that day. Just start uh, talking, and yeah, it really felt like normal again, being able to skate and be at the skate park and be around other skateboarders. I felt like I was in my element again because uh, yeah, I've been sitting on this lounge behind me for the last month or so, trying to wait for this ankle to get better, but. Yeah, super happy it's getting better. We're about to take a road trip. Well, Karina and I are about to take a road trip up to Washington next week. So, um, yeah, really keen to check out that part of California and that part of the Pacific Northwest. Almost said East. Pacific North, Pacific Northwest, sorry. So, yeah, we're going to be doing a little bit of road tripping and uh, skating. Really keen to check out some parks up that way. But, yeah. Glad I'm back making videos again. I feel great, feeling way better than I did before. So yeah, thank you for all you guys for watching. Make sure you head on over to eveningmob.com, pick up something. Um, if you pick something up from evening, I'll draw some cool stuff on the USPS envelope it comes on. So yeah, custom Sharpie illustrations from your boy. But yeah, anyway guys, thanks for watching the video and uh, yeah, I'll catch all you guys in the next one. Cheers. Like you